Thank you for viewing my video. This is my communication and organizations movie analysis on Office Space. Topic number one, seeking feedback from superiors. This also relates to superior subordinate communication and giving feedback and receiving feedback can sometimes be a little rocky. In this scene, the superiors are the ones seeking the feedback. They want to know exactly what everybody is doing. Tom is left defending his job, saying that he, he he's only here because he is the person to speak to, so the customers don't have to talk to the engineers directly. This is a form of giving feedback. He is explaining what his job is, and he explains what he does at the office. Well, in this case, the, there's a bad communication between the superiors and the subordinates. Tom thinks that he's in there defending his job, which in reality he was. So this was a little bit of a dishonest tactic used by the superiors. They were essentially, and it was stated in the movie, they were interviewing to keep their job. Stand it! What the hell is wrong with you people? Topic number two, bullying in the workplace. In this scene, Milton is being harassed by Bill Lindbergh, his boss. He tells him that he needs to move down to the basement. And this is not right because they would not ask anybody else. Milton is a character who is discriminated against and constantly bullied and constantly harassed throughout the movie. And in this scene, as you can tell, Milton is not very happy that he's being moved down to the basement. Milton is picked on throughout the movie. He's discriminated against partially because of his looks. He's kind of an odd guy. And he's looked down on by his superiors. If discrimination or bullying or harassment continue, it can even lead to acts of violence in the workplace. As we find out at the end of the movie, Milton is the one who ends up burning down the office because of all of the harassment that he had faced and the theft of his beloved stapler. And a can of pesticide and... Excuse me. Excuse me. But, okay, but that's the last draw. Topic number three, rituals. Help contribute to the culture of the organization. Rituals are social actions in which a group's values and identity are publicly demonstrated or enacted. This can be so many different things, but an office space, as you can see, and as we all know, that is, someone's got a case of the Mondays, and the uh, the iconic scene of when they go out and they smash the uh, fax machine. This is all part of the ritual. This is the ritual of of bonding, of creating a culture, and the culture which they have created within the organization is an anti-organizational culture itself. When the guys go out for coffee, they're participating in a ritual. And the ritual that fits the theme is anti-establishment. After the lady comes up and says, Oh, someone's got a case of the Mondays. That drives them crazy. It, she, her character is just such a, a pro-office environment. And these guys are the exact opposite. So the ritual that they take place in is being anti-establishment. And by going to get coffee, blowing off work, and leaving the environment, they are partaking in the ritual. I'll lose it. Uh-oh. Sounds like somebody's got a case of the Mondays. <laughs> Boy, I tell you, some days, one of these days, it's just going to be like... And that's it. Thank you for watching.